Well, I was hoping the Soyuz would be bigger, but it seems to be about the same size as the last time. <laughs> but I will do my best to uh, take notes for Oleg and Toma and uh, do timing events for them to keep track of things and just be supportive uh, in their role. Well, by, uh, judging by the outside looks, it doesn't really compare. But actually, the work is very similar. Uh, it's very procedure-based, uh, some very intense dynamic phases, and then some more uh, long-term phases where you're monitoring the systems, like being on a, on, a, on a cruise phase with the autopilot on, lots of interactions with the ground, teamwork, uh, and then again, a very dynamic phase for docking to the station, which is very similar to landing on a runway. It has inertia. Uh, the way you fly it is a little bit like a big airplane, so if you're asking me, I'm going to tell you that it's the closest there is um, to airline flying. Uh, and that's why I've, I've, I've always liked to, uh, to fly in the Soyuz, because it reminds me of, uh, of a time not so distant. Who's repeater? Who's repeater? 